Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to recover an administrator account if you're having an issue with maybe it's been deleted or if there's some sort of issue that in the accounts field it's not saying administrator when it in fact should be. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up the search menu and you want to type in settings best match, should come back with settings, go ahead and open that up. On the left side you want to scroll down and select Windows Update and then select Advanced Options on the right side. Scroll down underneath Additional Options and you want to select Recovery and you want to select underneath Recovery Options Advanced Startup. Restart your device to change startup settings including starting from a disk or USB drive. Select the Restart Now button and please make sure you save and close out of any open programs and applications before restarting your device. And then just go ahead and select restart. And you want to select the Troubleshoot option and select Advanced Options and then select Startup Settings. And now at this point you want to go ahead and select the Restart button. Tap the F5 key or Function 5 key on your keyboard. Again, it's the top key. It says F5. Go ahead and tap that. And it should launch you into safe mode with networking. You want to right click on the taskbar and select task manager. On the left side you want to select the user icon. So go ahead and select the profile icon or user icon. And you want to right click on your user account and select manage user accounts on that page. You minimize or close out of the task manager at this point. Select versus change your account type. And then at this point, you want to go ahead and enter in an administrator password if it requires one. Otherwise, you just want to go ahead and make sure it's set to administrator on this page. And then you would select change account type, close out of here, and then you would want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. Pretty straightforward process. Hopefully that was able to help resolve your issue. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.